Hi friends, today's topic of discussion is circuit number 2 control of double acting cylinder or DA cylinder. It is one of the hydraulic circuit. Here there is no spring on the piston rod. Here it is using 4x3 solenoid control DC valve. 4 because it has 4 ports or 4 connections. 3 because it has 3 positions. Based on different position of DC valve, it has piston has three type of motion: piston extending, piston retracting, and hold position where piston is not moving. So let us start with piston extending. Solenoid valve operates at set value, and pressurized oil will enter port A into the DA cylinder piston will move from left to right since oil is admitted on the front face of the piston the movement is called piston extending during this movement oil on the other side of the piston that is piston rod side will automatically return to the oil tank via DC valve. Now piston retracting. Now again the solenoid valve will operate to its second setting. Now the pressurized oil will be supplied to the through port B via DC valve and it will be supplied to port B. Due to the pressure of oil, piston will move from right to left. The oil on the other side of the piston will return to oil tank via DC valve. So this was piston retracting. Now the third motion of the piston that is no movement of the piston or hold position. As you can see in this position pressurized oil is not going to the DA cylinder it is returning to the tank. This is called hold position it keeps the actuator on hold there is no movement of piston on either side. So this was circuit number 2 control of double acting cylinder. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching.